I did so your tutorials are very useful. Thanks. Can you make a jelly cube tutorial <laughs> that works with Unity? This is one of the rare requests I got where I have exactly what the user is uh, looking for on my channel and I just copied the video he's there and he was happy. So here is a video. It, it It's amazing. It's like um, he wants to trick me. So it's exactly what he was asking for. I called it how to create mesh from code. Um, I think the name wasn't good enough. I, I should have named it Jelly Cube or something like that. In line 22 of the script input vector does come up. This is this is the running gag. Next, is this asset compatible with Unity 2018.3b? All my assets are compatible with every version of Unity except the one asset that I used in a video where I showed you how to create a mobile input. This asset was updated and after that my tutorial explanation was outdated only a little bit. You have to just have a deeper look at the error then it's fixable. Um, but yes, compatible with every Unity version, compatible with every platform. I love the dog animation, lol. So he is referring to my Blender 2.8 and Unity video where I showed you how you can do everything in Blender and import it into Unity. Created the mesh, rigged the mesh, animated the mesh and I want to do it very quickly and in one video, everything in one video packed half an hour so I don't spend the time on really make a beautiful mesh, make a beautiful rig and make a beautiful animation and this is what came out. Um, so <laughs> the animation was wrong but I'm like okay that's it. You know how to move bones. That should be enough. I just put it out and they laughed about this. It's okay. It's not a beautiful animation but it's an animation. How did you get two divided screen? Um, I don't have posted anything with a divided screen. So if you want to have a split screen then just google it or just search it on YouTube. There are plenty of tutorials that show how to do it. I do not want to put out a video that's already there with a good quality. And there are some videos with a very good quality out there. So I don't have to do it. Subscribe to my channel to get more straight to the point tutorials.